I've been asked to do a simplified version of a glitter tip. So I've started with the entire nail done in Overtly Onyx. And I'm going to polish over the Overtly Onyx with Vexed Violet just to give me a deeper shade. And I've seen someone post this as steel purple and I think that is definitely a great description. That little bit of frost in the Vex Violet definitely makes this color look steely. After I've applied a thin coat of the Vexed Violet over the Overtly Onyx, we're going to cure that for two minutes. Hey, welcome to another fingernail fixer video. I've been asked to do a simplified version of a glitter tip for French. I have some glitter. This is just bling from Recollections. This is the cured book vexed violet over the overtly onyx. I'm just going to take the gel brush. It's a C and D gel oval number six. I'm going to place it dry into the glitter and I'm going to tap some of the excess off. So there's not a lot of glitter on the brush. And then I'm gently going to come in and actually place it in the shape of a smile line. I'm just going to keep repeating that carefully trying to get a minimum of glitter up into zone 2 and 3. So I'm essentially freehanding the tip. Once I have the French line in place, I'm going to go ahead and come in with a little more glitter and start pressing it down onto the tip to create that French look. Then I'm going to dust off the excess. Now's where you want to come in and clean up the smile line. And the reason I love to do this with the gel oval number six is I can turn the back of the brush around and use the back of the brush to clean up that smile. So I'm just gently pushing the glitter down because the vexed violet is cured so it's not going anywhere. I'm not going to mess it up. Every so often I'll just wipe the back of my brush off to remove the excess glitter. And this does take a little more time than using a glitter paste, but it leaves a smoother tip versus having that little bit of a lump at the end because it's thicker from the glitter paste. And now as you can see, it's pretty easy to clean the glitter up with the back of that brush. Once I have the glitter down to the smile line, I'm just going to kind of look over the nail and make sure I'm happy. I know I'm being a little picky. I'm going to come in and use a little bit of top coat. And I'm going to top coat only the French tip. Making sure to use a very, very thin coat of the top coat. I'm going to cure this for two minutes. Then when I bring that out of the lamp after the two minutes, I'm going to put top coat over the entire nail and then cure that for two minutes. Hope this gives you an easier version of the Glitter French. Have fun.